Emergency room visits are up at Carteret Healthcare in Moorhead City as people head to the beach for spring break this weekend. All this is putting a strain on hospital staff and healthcare workers. News Channel 12's Kate Hussey checked in with the hospital today and joins us live now. Kate, is the hospital overwhelmed? Well, the good news is even though the hospital is seeing that uptick, they are not in crisis mode. They have been able to keep up with the demand so far. But the concern here is that this influx of people is only expected to increase the further into the summer we get, something business owners and residents in the area are already seeing. All hands are on deck at the Atlantis Lodge in Pineal Shores. As staff tried to keep up with an unprecedented amount of visitors. We look at almost 100% occupancy from mid-February through mid-October. So we're just full all the time. This year is, is setting up to be our best year yet. And it's not just the lodge. Hall says this holiday weekend, the entire barrier island is packed with visitors. It does get crazy busy, you know, during the, during the holiday weekends especially. It's the traffic on the island trying to get from point A to point B and the restaurants are full. Yet tourist attractions and beaches aren't the only things filling up with spring breakers. According to Carter at Healthcare, the hospital is too. The amount of visitors to its emergency department spiking Easter weekend compared to the previous two. Communications and marketing director for the hospital, Michelle Lee, says while the uptick can be taxing on staff, they've been able to keep up with the demand and are not in crisis mode. Yet Lee says many of these visits can be prevented. If it's not an emergency, go to a primary care physician, the health department, even a pharmacy. She says COVID tests can be done outside of the ER. Something she hopes people take to mind as business owners like Hall anticipate even more traffic the farther into the summer we get. We do see those holiday weekends like July 4th. It just seems like more people pack into the rooms. You know, it's all good. That's what we're here for. Well, Lee says the hospital does have at least two to four providers staffed in the ER at all times. She also encourages anyone who does need emergency medical attention to come on in. In fact, you can actually check ER wait times online. You'll find a link to that by heading to our website. That's WCTI12.com. Reporting live in Carteret County tonight, I'm Kate Hussey for News Channel 12.